All right, we got Patchley now because I believe Romelia has switched out. Court is now in session. Have the defense and prosecution both made their preparations. Preparations complete, your honor. The defense is also ready, your honor. Very well. Now then, may I have your opening statement, Miss Knowledge? Of course, your honor. The defendant is Miss Marissa Kirisama being charged with larceny. The Adonson absent article is a pot in the possession of Miss Erin Yagokoro. I don't even know how this word is, so you know what? Whatever. It wouldn't be the first word I couldn't say for shit. The defendant was arrested in the vicinity of where the incident occurred soon after the theft. While she did not have the pot when she was arrested, she is the prime suspect due to the condition of the crime and her criminal record. That is the synopsis, synopsis? I think I've said it right, of this case. Ooh, she's serious about this. This might be harder than I thought. So, the defendant is Miss Marissa Kirisame. <laughs> guilty! <laughs> Bitch doesn't mean to think it's a- You guilty! Whoa, wait, wait, wait! What is it, Miss Shamimaru? You dare object to an Emma's ruling? No, that's not it. We need to debate about this. It's a trial after all. What if the one who alerted the authority is the one who actually did it? Hmm, as usual, you have a way of words. Okay, if I were to pass judgment now, it wouldn't be much of a trial anyway. I can't believe I have to argue just to be able to defend. <laughs> Aki's like, oh, bitch, Marissa, you fucking, you, 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 you guilty. Girl, you fucking guilty. Now, the defendant will approach the stand. Your name and occupation, if you please. Man, what's your deal? Rude as ever. You're one to talk. Tch, I'm Marissa Kurosame, a very ordinary magician. I can argue, I can agree with the magician part, but I don't think the very ordinary is quite right. You were apprehended on the afternoon of April 30th near Iente. Is that correct? Yeah, pretty much. You were charged with larcen larceny for stealing a pot. Is that also correct? Oh, please tell me I'm actually saying this word right too. Now that I think about it. I don't know, man. I, I always do double doubt myself when it comes to s saying out words, man. Oh, I don't know, man. <laughs> you know me. I can't say words for shit. But to be fair, majority of those words are Japanese. So, you know what? That's kind of tricky. And at times, they're not. And I still can't say it for shit. So, you know what? Whatever. If you're talking about why I was arrested, then yeah. I'm not the one who stole that pot, though. Just answer what you've been asked. What's wrong with you? You don't need to be all snippy. This is bad. Miss Kurisama doesn't have any spell cards right now. Should I intervene for her? Let's save. All right. Intervene just in case. Stop badgering the defendant. What's the matter? Does she lack the Philosopher's Stone for it? What did you just say? Your voice sounds rather strained. Maybe you don't after all. Ugh. Is, is Miss Kurosama going to start crying? So I take it that the defense will be arguing the case for the defendant's innocent. innocence. I'm not so sure if they are even on the same page. What do you have to say, Miss Shamimaru? Do I truly believe in Marissa's innocence? Believe. Of course we do. The defense will not compromise in our pursuit of the truth. Yeah, that's more like it. Knock him dead. Hmm, mere bravado won't get you anywhere. You looked rather cool there, Aya. Okay, if that is all, let us begin. Does the prosecution have a witness prepared? Naturally, and I believe that her testimony will be convincing and decisive. Show her to the witness stand, please. Alright, now the real battle begins. I don't know who this witness is, but I have no choice but to go full speed ahead. Please tell the court your name and occupation, witness. Alice Margotrode, I'm a magician. A little old to be playing with dolls, aren't we? What does that have to do with anything? She wished to bring it with her. I ask for your approval, your honor. Well, it shouldn't obstruct the proceedings, proceedings, so I shall allow it. Thank you for your kind consideration, your honor. Yo, man, <laughs> the judge is calling Alice out. You know, for being a puppeteer and shit, or whatever. Now then, your testimony, witness. As long as I can leave soon afterwards. Witness testimony. Alright, let's save again. 
On April 30th, I unexpectedly found myself near Iente. All right. So you know I need to save a lot of shit now. After that last um, trial, I have to be sure to be on point. All right, you're near Iente. Then I saw Marissa flying on her broom. It seemed like she was in a hurry for some reason. Stealing is like second nature to her, to her so I didn't think twice about it. <laughs> I wasn't expecting a decisive eyewitness account like that. Oh, I can't find any holes in it either. I hope you've already prepared to go home. Um, was the defense cross-examined? Yes, of course we will. What else did you think we were going to do? Now she's mad. There are some holes. You see her rushing, but did she say rushing to Ian Tay? We'll have to see. We'll have to see. On April 3rd, I was expecting to find myself near Ian Tay. How did you end up there? Good question. There was something I needed to take care of in another forest. I was just passing by. She was the first one to notify us about the theft. Then I saw Marissa flying on her broom. From where was she flying? It looked like she was leaving from Iente the way I saw it. What was her behavior at the time? Whoa! It seemed like she was in a hurry for some reason. In a hurry? Yes, I'm fairly certain she was flying as fast as she could. Really? That's because... Stealing is like second nature to her, so I didn't think twice about it. What makes you think of that? She had a pot with her at the time, of course. She had the pot, you say? Thank you, honey. The witness told us exactly what she saw. I doubt she is leaving out any details. I believe so too. Does the defense have any further requests? Should I back off now? Maybe I should rethink this. So make a request for now. I don't think I understand the whole picture. Better listen to her testimony again. No, I'd like to cross-examine her a little more. Please, your honor. Hmm, very well. Find myself near Iente. How do you- Oh yeah, I already said this. Okay. Yep. Seems like she was in a horror for some reason. Yep. She's stealing a second nature, so I didn't think twice about it. Ah oh, yeah, there must be something you can find in her testimony. Don't give up now. Yep. I'm gonna go, go that, deal with that again. Was it that one? Or is it something else? Yeah, there you go. Alright. Make a request. Of course I do, because I believe there is a de definite contradiction in her testimony. Oh, I see. What does what does that mean you have evidence to the contrary? Yes, of course I have proof. Please present it then. Um, here it is, your honor. Present proof of a contradiction. Let's see. Can I save? Oh shit. Oh, I can save. It's a quick save. There you go. There you go. So there's a quick save there. So I can use that for later. And then I can load it right after too, I believe. Let's see. Aaron's pot was stolen, but it's not. Maybe this? There's evidence bouquet, yes. Okay. Okay, whatever. We'll just keep going and then we'll reset it after we get like the right one and then continue from there. Uh, let's see. T present. The evidence is clearly written right here. All right, so let's load that. It looks like we're getting good stuff from there. Present proof. All right. This may be cheesing it, but we'll do that. Present. Was arrested approximately 20 minutes after the incident occurred. The evidence is clearly written here. The defendant was arrested roughly 20 minutes after the death occurred. And regardless of that, she didn't have the pot at the time either. But the defendant is a magician. Isn't it, isn't it possible that she used magic to move it away? Oh uh, yeah, this one should be easy. Uh, wait, which what? no special abilities? Yeah, Renosuke. Oh, I guess that was it. 
Nope. Resent. No, she could not have done that. I have here a signed statement from Miss Morchika. He states that that kind of magic is not a def uh, defendant's specialty. She possesses no ability to use magic based on teleportation or otherwise manipulating objects. This is why she could not have committed this crime. I suppose you are one of those so-called bird brains. Shouldn't it be obvious? Since the defendant couldn't conveniently whisk away this pot, the pot, this part of the uh, witness's testimony is false. Which means at this point in time, I question the validity of her entire testimony. Hmm. What, what is the meaning of this? That's honestly what I saw. Then please give us a more detailed test testimony. I would have to agree with the defense on this. The witness testimony is entirely too vague. I can't believe this. Ah! What is the matter, witness? Let's save again because I have the chance to do it now. Okay. I'm very sorry, but I just remembered something very important. May I add to my testimony? Are you serious? You should have said it in your in initial testimony. I couldn't help it. I had forgotten about it, but now I remember what it was. Would this be something to, to which I am not privy? Privy or whatever? It's about half and half. But once I say it, then we'll both know everything. There's more than just you and me in the room right now, you know. Don't worry so much. Nothing must be left unsaid. Give your complete testimony this time. Oh yes, of course. Okay, what I remembered. I only got a brief glimpse of her over my shoulder. That's why I was probably mistaken about her having the pot. But then I remembered something. The owner of Corno made something that could move lost objects into his shop easily. Hmm? Since I remembered that, I wonder why Marissa was flying in a different direction holding something. Your testimony is a little unclear, but I understand what you wanted to say. That's quite a bit that is new in the witness's testimony, so we must cover everything thoroughly. Arrgh, everyone's prejudice, prejudice against Miss Kirisame is the biggest obstacle here, but I can't entirely disagree either. Now, your cross-examination, Miss Shamimaru, if you can, that is. Yes, I can! 